please, please, I don't want to go. I don't want to go. Spider-Man Far From Home next summer in theater. Hey guys, Mr. Everything here, back in another quick video, and in today's video, we're going to be talking about why Marvel should stop faking deaths. Alright, so the topic of this video, I just sort of came up on my own, and I hope you guys enjoyed those clips at the beginning. That's sort of my motivation for this video, because when you really think about it, you see all of these characters die in Infinity War, and they completely undo it when they have Tom Holland go on like Jimmy Kimmel Live or something and say, oh yeah, by the way, Spider-Man Far From Home in theaters. Now to be fair, Spider-Man and Black Panther, we already knew they both were getting seen sequels marvel didn't even confirm them at the time but we knew they were getting sequels so it was pretty obvious at that point but still you know marvel should stop faking deaths and i think the number one reason why they should stop faking deaths is because you lose consequences i think that's the main reason because every time you kill a character off which they have did this multiple times they just bring them back Loki is a great example of that. They just bring him back multiple times and it's just like, oh, is he really dead? Is he not dead? Why do you think there's so many is Loki dead theories in Infinity War? Why do you think there's so many? Because Marvel created that. They created the whole thing of believing that characters are still alive, even though this time I do believe Loki is dead. And the Russo brothers haven't like 100,000% confirmed that, but they pretty much confirmed just by this one line of dialogue. No resurrections this time. And I think that line of dialogue right there pretty much is the writers and the Russo brothers saying, hey guys, this death is final. This is not a fake death. This is a final death. But yet again, they kind of trained the audience to have that mindset going into these Marvel films. So when anybody dies, everybody automatically thinks, oh, they're coming back. Spider-Man, he's definitely coming back. So it's like they sort of have that mindset. So yet again, you sort of lose consequences. And how great some of those death scenes are, Loki's death scene, Spider-Man's death scene, Gamora's death scene, Scene, you know most of them are coming back like i said i believe loki is dead but spider-man you know black panther all of them you know they're coming back so it just sort of loses consequences just a slight bit and the same thing goes for dc i mean they did it a couple times as well you know with superman and it's just like it just loses the consequences and i think marvel and dc uh, i guess this could be a dc video too in any movie period i just think they should stop doing the fake death thing it's just played out to this point and you know yet again audiences whenever they see somebody die they're sort of trained at this point to believe that oh they're coming back so anyway guys you guys give me your thoughts on this topic be sure to like subscribe if you guys are new check out my other movie news videos marvel videos avengers 4 videos and have a great rest of your day all right bye guys